Gemini and welcome to your reading. So this is a prediction for the month of May 2023. If you are a Gemini sun, moon or rising, then this is for you. This is also a collective reading. So if it doesn't resonate with you at all, you can check your sun, moon and rising video on my channel or you can head over to my Instagram, Chelsea Therese, where I do online personal readings as well. Okay, so we're going to jump straight into it. So Gemini for May, we have the King of Cups energy, which is compassion, control, um, masculine, feeling very balanced, full of love. Um, so there is an energy of that, a very masculine, loving energy. And it's backed by the Ace of Swords in reverse, which is a lot of confusion, a lot of brutality, and a lot of chaos around this energy. There is a lot of chaos. So there may be an emotional masculine figure that could be a Scorpio, as this is known as the Scorpion card. But it could just be... Um, a masculine energy that is very much confu confusing and very brutal. That is the energy you could be showing up as that. That is the energy that you are in at the moment, Gemini. And what is coming for you is the Eight of Cups in reverse, which you're fearing change. You're avoiding something. You have a f you you fear you have a fear of loss. You just avoiding this change that is fucking about to smash you in the face, and literally it's coming. It is coming, Gemini. It's going to be revealed to you. You're going to have a huge reflection, a huge awakening about this thing that you so much are avoiding changing. And you're going to have a real big awakening internally. So it may not be on the external, but within yourself, you're going to be like, oh my God, I can't believe all of this is piecing together is pretty much what you're saying. I can't believe this is all starting to make sense. The hidden energy for you is the nine of swords in reverse. So the hidden energy is... Um, having hope for a situation that it seems as though a loving situation. You're also showing up with your card here, the Gemini card, the lovers, but you're in reverse. So it it's having hope for a situation that is one-sided, having hope for a situation that is that has no balance and it's all about just one person. It's not really a partnership because it's all about this one individual. But that is the hidden energy is that you do have hope for it, unfortunately. In your love energy, we have new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. And romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. What somebody is thinking about you through the month of May, Gemini, is I can't stop thinking about you. I couldn't let you get close to me. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. I will wait for a sign from you. So... I'm going to read that one more time, Gemini. I can't stop thinking about you. I couldn't let you get close to me. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. I will wait for a sign from you. So that is what somebody is thinking about you, Gemini. And it seems that they're waiting for you to come back to them. Um, and it seems that you were trying to get closer to them, but they were trying to hold you a distance because they weren't ready for what you were ready for but now it seems as though that they now that they don't have you they want you back hmm. okay gemini i hope you enjoy the month of may sending you lots of love and light